did you erase some of them so that it'll record? Okay. I didn't know. Yeah. Hey, Sharon. Hey, Joy. Hey, 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 y'all. Hey, Kathy, good afternoon. Hey, Bree. Hey, Honey Bee. Hey, Lewis. Hey, Scooby. Scooby hey, Noama. Oh, hey, Joni. Hey, Queen G3, G3. I hope I said that right. Hey, Cynthia McCaulkin. I hope I said right. Hey, Margot. Hey, Reggie. Hey, Ruby Bond. Hey, Martin, what's going on? Hey, Elsie. Janet Jackson being Charlotte. All right. Hey, Charlena. Uh, Happy Friday. Okay. Doing good, JP. Appreciate it. Hope you're doing well today. What's going on, King Capricorn? Yeah, I'm a Capricorn. All right. He's going to uh, email it before six. Okay. Hey, Antonio. Hey, Kristen. Terry Harvey. Hey, Cheryl Williams. <laughs> I'm saying stand up so they can see your outfit. She's just lounging today. <laughs> She's just lounging. What's up, Antonio? Thank you, Antonio. Hey, Queen Size Barber. Yeah, look, it's so peaceful. It's peaceful over here. <laughs> yeah, it's peaceful over here. I can, I can guarantee you, it's peaceful over here. This one you talking about? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, for my, my cucumbers. Okay. Yeah. What's going on, ALB? Getting closer to the wedding. Yes, it is. I'm ready for it to come. Come on, come on, come on. Hey, Belinda. Hey, Shabonda. Hope I said your name right. Hey, Shay Robinson. Hey, Shawnee. Oh. It's not us. I'm going to go. <laughs> well, some people are new. Some people are new. <laughs> so. Ooh, wee. <laughs> Hey, Lisa Ellis. Thank you, Shavonda. Uh, we good be 1938-08-93. They were reading that off like a prison number. I'm just saying. <laughs> hey, I like those. Thank you, Shavonda. <laughs> uh, how that the was week cute. so far? How the week so far? The week is all right. The, 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 week, the week is all right. Um, you know what? I ain't... Can't complain. Can't complain because there ain't nothing I can do about it. It could be worse. Yes. <laughs> Chabon to say prison number. All right. <laughs> <laughs> uh, thank you, Lisa Ellis. Hey, Linda Mack. Oh, yeah. It's going to be good today. It's, uh, the topic going to be good today. <clears throat> hey, Deborah, blessed by the best. So I know we never get ready to eat. You ready? All right, well, we can get into it. You want to get into it first, and then okay, I'm asking. No, okay. Ah, okay. Hey, truck driver, wife, what's happening? I'm new. What is the topic? We're about to get into it. <laughs> what? Well, let me ask you something. Let me ask y'all something. I don't look. I'm not talking to animals today. Y'all got have your own day, so I, I don't speak animal language today. Okay. So those of you that don't understand animal language, please step to the side and we're going to get with y'all on Saturday. <laughs> anyway, um, let me ask y'all something. When y'all click on the live, like when you open it up to get in here and speak and say, hey, y'all, don't it have, don't it, don't it uh, have the topic when it, when you first come in? The, it, it do the guidelines first and then it have the topic. I'm just trying to see something. It do that. Okay, so I'm not tripping when when I get mad when people get in here and don't read that what the topic is, you know, and then they want me to tell them and they 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 can read it. 
Okay, okay, all right. I'm just making sure I'm not tripping. Okay. All right, so so any one of y'all, would y'all be, you know, kind to pin the the topic for our 270 guests, please? Whew. Um, it would be greatly appreciated. <laughs> well, Linda, when you go go out of the live and come back and it'll pop up, that'll be the first thing you see. It'll talk guidelines and then it'll have the topic right up under there. <clears throat> <laughs> the hard truth. Thank you. Thank you, peacefully. Thank you. Thank you. The hard truth. The hard truth. That's what it is. Some people don't like to hear the hard truth. What you told me the other day when I, I said people don't when I said people don't like to hear the hard truth and you said and you what you said after that? You you how you said it. What you say when I said people I don't, don't like know. the hard truth? I don't know. You said something about people don't like to hear the truth. Or, uh, no, people don't. They they want because we had a live almost like this before. It wasn't to like this degree, but it was like where I I had asked everybody, would you like to be told the truth? And every majority of the people said yes. Well, you say that because you're thinking a person's going to tell you what you want to hear. But, I want but as the soon truth. as they don't tell you what you want to hear, then you get upset. They get so mad everybody can't handle the truth. But why? And it's majority the truth. of people can't handle the truth. They just say yes because they think that you're going to tell them what they want to hear. I, I kid you not. Okay, that this help me out, y'all. Why people people don't like the truth when it's the truth? Why people don't like the, the truth? That's almost like if I ask you, do I talk too much? Well, I'm expecting you to say no, no, you don't. But so, why? so when you say yes, you do. I'll be like. Oh, but why? It's the truth. Well, it's not the truth. It'll it is be, the it's, truth. No, it'll no. be my truth. You right. see what I'm saying? But it is the truth. I do. That's only if you agree with it. But if I say you talk, right. talk too much, if I think you talk too much, mm -hmm. and you ask me if you talk too much, I'm going to tell you my truth. Yeah. Yes, you do. Right. You see what I'm saying? But then that person's automatically going to get upset with you because they thought you were going to say, no, almost kind of like, you think I'm fat? Well, you have gained some weight. <sighs> You know what I'm saying? And so that's just the mild cases there. Just imagine the stuff that... You said because it's not their truth. But you know what, Queen? My thing is, even though it's not their truth, but you ask that person for their opinion. So you have to, you know... Hey, meet the legend. Hey, legend. You have to take their truth because it hurts sometimes. But you but know, you know what? what? I'd rather, I'd ra I'd rather take that sting. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Than to have a friend you so-called... Uh, a person that's going to be my friend, I'd rather you be truthful for me and just say, you know what, it's going to hurt her, but right. she's going to appreciate me being truthful with her in the end. Then to sit up here and lie to you, and then later on, then it'd be like, well, I was going to tell you. You know how that go, y'all. So I'd rather <laughs> you tell me my feelings may be hurt, I, but i get over it. I'm man. Okay, now I got Things another question. No one likes the truth. But it's Like it's it's the truth. My thing is is when somebody's telling you the truth about a situation, it's for you to own your part in it and either change it or move away from it. My question brings me to my question at hand. How many times do a person have to tell you that they don't want you before you get it that they don't want you? I'm, I'm just trying to see and be truthful. How many times somebody got to tell you that they don't want you before they start showing you that they don't want you? Or does it take them showing you that they don't want you instead of, you know, you, you hearing it? <laughs> you can it never be gentle with the truth. It, it cuts. People, <laughs> people don't, don't like, like accountability. accountability. No. Even once. So people are saying once. Man. If you ask me, I will tell you, you what do, I think. The, the truth, yeah. yeah. So, uh, see, everybody's saying one, but... But see, that's the same thing about the truth. They're saying once, but... Yeah. You know, I'm sure a lot of people, if they look back at their relationships, <laughs> they look back and they had to be I told or shown this multiple this times. I done sucker about four got dog on time. How many times do you forgive somebody for something that they ain't changing? Okay, let me ask you again. Let me ask you Because I know I, I have been shown... I have been shown right. that 
uh, you know, with my 20s, I've been shown that that he didn't want me. Right. But I was like, all right. He don't know what he's talking about. He's going he, you want me. You know what I'm saying? So I know I've been there. Y'all had to have been there because we all have done I, some You know what? Stuff. I never looked at it as a want. But my, my thing is, I was always loving an individual. I felt I always had this saying that if I love a person hard enough, they'll just love me right back. And see, and Deborah said back in the day, it took her a while for her to wake up. So she admitted, see, that, <laughs> but see, you're taking accountability. It, it took me a while, too. It took me a while, too. It did. You couldn't see the forest for the trees? Yeah. We all <laughs> been there. So it's been more than once that somebody had to tell you. They Sometimes they had to show you that they don't want you because it's a hard, it's and, a hard and, pill and to the swallow. Thing, the thing is about being shown, when you're being shown that the person don't want you, it leads up to disrespect. Right? Yeah. A person, when they show you that they don't want you, they literally disrespecting you. I mean, I, uh, <laughs> I mean, when they doing stuff that you constantly tell them that you don't like and they continuously doing it, they telling you how they feel about you. Hey, Miss Joy. Hey, Miss Joy. Hey, Smitty. Hey, Smitty. Right? Yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm, but in your but in your head, you know, you're not ready ready for that that that's that bite, you know, that reality. You're not ready for that taste of reality yet. Man, I mean, sometimes what gets so me is they punchy. choose they choose chaos over peace. I'd rather have peace. Yeah. I'd rather, yeah, so I'd some r- people, yeah, some people they it's, it's it's the it's the drama. They like the drama that comes along with it. And if you not if you don't have that drama, then you don't love me. Some people look at it that way too. If he ain't jealous and acting a the fool, then he don't love me. So they rather see all but the they, extra. But, but the thing is, is, they didn't have to do that in the beginning to get him. You, you ain't have to get slapped around in the beginning to to know you've been loved. You you and people ain't got to call you out your name to to prove that they love you. So why so why why the change? Like why does it? <sighs> Why does it take all that? We just say, oh, song break up to make up. That's all we do. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Oh, man. I'm, I'm just, all I'm saying is I I choose peace over chaos. Yeah. You know? But that's now. Then you don't, you didn't, we didn't know no better. But for the people who are still like going through that and, you You're in your 30s and your 40s your 40s, and your 50s yeah. and you're still going through that? Come on, you got to wake At up. Some At some point, do you wake yeah. up? Yeah. That's why I ask, how many times do a person have to tell you that they don't want you? How many times do you ha- it, have to I'm hold sorry. on to a friendship that show you that they ain't your friend? You finna fix the pool, right? Yeah, I got okay. to start, man. All right. Um, I'm just... Whew. Thank you, love. You need me to get up and do something? Mm-hmm. Okay. All right. I'm trying to help. <laughs> um, I don't know. I my thing is 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 I've been there. I've been there where I've allowed people to disrespect me, disrespect the relationship, um, go on with what they wanted and disregard what I want. I had to learn, you know, and I think I think baby today, you know, for teaching me a lot of things. You know, she would say so she when we first got together, she would say, it be, it's a lot of stuff you don't have to accept that. If a person respects you, they're gonna respect you. If they don't, they're gonna show you. If a person don't meet you halfway, if somebody tell you, hey, I got a problem with such, 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 and such, and you disregard how I feel. About me feeling about that such such you telling me how you feel about me. So it's not for that person to fix it. It's for me to remove myself. It's for me to say, okay, <laughs> you ain't got to tell me but one time. Thank you, baby. Um, you gotta remove yourself from certain situation. I don't care how bad you wanna be with that person, I don't care how long you've been with that person, I don't care how long you've been knowing that individual. I don't care. You have to pick yourself. You got to choose yourself. You know, um, yeah. Don't, don't, and, and uh, look here. Yeah, I'm not, I'm, I'm, 
Women are just the same as men, but it's worse for a man to tell don't don't let a man tell you twice that he don't want you. Don't let a man tell you twice that he don't want you. The first time should be enough. Oh man. Anyway, y'all bow your heads so we but so we can pray for our food. Lord, thank you for this food we're about to receive. In the name of Jesus, we pray, Lord. Amen. Amen. Amen, amen, amen. again. Yeah, oh. I think that people feel like, well, we've been together 10 years or five years. I'm and man. they rather they rather take that hit for the, those five years than to just, mm. you know, I mean, it's, mm. it's, it's ran its course. I mean. It's not when a man tell you he don't want you. Yeah. Then the man show you he don't want you. That, that 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 says a lot about you as a woman. Mm. I'm just saying, y'all. Taste it. Mm-hmm. That's it. That's it? Yep. Okay. Um It's it's real it's runny, so mm -hmm. you say, but if you're blinded by love, you may choose not to see. That's not love though. You know what, Deborah? That's not that's not love. That that's an insecurity within a person's self about how they see themselves. That's not love. And you're no longer in a relationship because it takes two. Mm -hmm. So that person's not in it no more, at least emotionally. Yeah, yeah. When a man then showed you how he feel, and you constantly tell that man, "Hey, what's going on, Shanae Nay?" Hey, when, when a man tell you how he feel, or you tell that man how you feel, and both parties disregard the, how the, a person's feeling, they they telling you where they at. You can't make somebody do something that they don't that they don't have the desire to do. Right. You can't <laughs> make somebody. Uh, you can't make somebody want you. If they don't have the desire to do it, you can't make them do it. So, I'm, I'm going to play with this chicken with this fork. I'm going to pick it up with my finger. Mm-mm. That's that barbecue hot sauce, y'all. <clears throat> um, you ain't got to tell me twice that you don't want me. Well, I mean, I'm, I, if, you was, if you wasn't on here more when I said it, I say man or woman. But it's usually a man that's, you don't want a man to tell you twice that he don't want you. A man, a, a whole man. <laughs> you don't want that man to tell you twice that he don't want you. Whew. Anyway, um, but that goes for any, anything. Friend, job, anything. Because a woman will stick it out. Before a man will, a woman mm -hmm. stick it out. A man can tell a woman or show a woman that that he don't want her, <laughs> and she will stick it out because he'll change. Or you, you know, like you, like maybe mm -hmm. say you try to make somebody want you. Mm -hmm. It's very rare that a man. I mean, you have your circumstances where you know some men that hang around with you, tell them you don't want them. Mm -hmm. Ain't but, no man gonna hang out with Ain't no man gonna do that. Mm -hmm. Ain't no man gonna put up with that. But it's either or. Man or woman? Mm -hmm. A man is just gonna go out there and go get, so get how, out there and cheat on you. So how old were you? <clears throat> how old were you? How how old were you when you stopped accepting? Uh, you know, for people like you said, they shouldn't have to tell you twice that they don't want you. Mm -hmm. So Party. how old were you when you got it? Forty eight. Forty eight. <laughs> Forty eight. <laughs> Cause I'm speaking on friendships and things. Okay, I'm, okay. So not just, so, so it's not just, not just relationships. relationships. Okay, okay. Yeah, I'm, I'm speaking on friendships. We're talking things. about all kinds of ships, y'all. Yeah. Friendships, relationships. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Cousinship. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so. Cause but I wanted, think it's harder I wanted to... them people to be in my life. Mm-hmm. 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 <laughs> mm -hmm. Well, um, 
it's a lifelong lesson. It's, 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 it's yeah. hurtful. It's hurtful. And um, it's one thing for them to do it to you and you within the relationship. But then you have your friends and your family looking at you go through that crap. And it's making a person look foolish. Mm -hmm. And you, I'd rather hurt than look like a fool. I'd, I'd rather hurt than been, be out here looking like a fool to everybody. Hurt me. <laughs> I get over it at some point. Mm -hmm. What you saying? Don't say nothing, just be gone? Mm hmm. What you gonna say something for? They don't care. <laughs> <laughs> Mm -hmm. And then I have read somewhere a relationship should be your happy place, mm -hmm. not a place where you beg somebody to do right. I don't want to beg nobody to be with you. No. Mm -hmm. The person gonna do right. They it 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 it's a desire. It's a desire. That's all. That's all I can say is is, you know. I wake up every day, thank God for a blessed day. I thank Him for my family, and and the and when I continue, when I go on with my day, my day consists of how can I make her happy, how can I make her smile. You know what? Mm, that's what I, I'm. I'm constantly wondering what I can do to make her smile. And if you got a relationship that ain't trying to make you smile, make you happy. And they concern themselves about what other people think. You in the wrong relationship. I don't care. I don't even know any motherfucker. I'm sorry. Don't do anything to prove to anybody else. Yeah. Only person that should matter in your relationship is your relationship. Hmm. Shit. Shit. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. So. Hmm. But I'm just saying. It's unfortunate though. People are, and I like you said, I don't know if it's a self-esteem issue because you feel like you can't get nobody else. Hey, Tasha. Hey, Tasha. What you mean? But I'd be like, the the you you try to stick it out, you know. But you just you can get somebody else just like you got that person. That's what I'm saying. But sometimes people that that spouse whether it be male or female put it in other person's head because i've seen it time you know mm -hmm. before where they'll say oh, you ain't gonna be able to get nobody else but like that's, a, that's a sense of control you wait, okay like, okay, okay. Else that's like a sense of control and then my my next question is gonna be when you gonna stand up and be independent for yourself when you gonna take and take and and, and say i can do this mm -hmm. and not it not accept disrespect um, I'll tell you what, I hit home when my mama told me that though. My mom said, don't ever let a man tell you twice he don't want you. Hmm. Ha! Ha! He had to tell me but one time, that was it. <laughs> <laughs> I've been gone ever since. Ha <laughs> ha! I've been here but one time to tell me. Shit. <laughs> I've been gone ever since. <laughs> Oh man, <laughs> shit. <laughs> mm -hmm. And don't regret the, the and don't regret leaving. Mm -hmm. Well, I mean, you know, you. And the thing is, it's not easy. Mm hmm. Because again, we all been there. It's not easy, but believe me, you'll get over it. Mm hmm. You you know you have to think about where you was before you even met that person. Yep. And you'll get over it. First you say, if, if he act like he don't want me, I'm leaving. <laughs> you say, only when they get to the end of their journey, some are longer than others. Yeah, it's true. Some are yeah. longer than others. Yeah, you will be fine. You say, I had a, a chick lie about her sexuality when I knew her for years, and her actions said, her actions said different. Mm. Uh, and then you would look back and say, what was I thinking? <laughs> because we all have. Yep. I know I do. Mm -hmm. I remember, she even said sometimes, she'd be like, what, what, just out of mm -hmm. what was I thinking? Mm -hmm. 
it's just hey, it's part of life. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I've been in relationships where, you know, people hear the relationship because they didn't want their mom to find out, they didn't want their dad to find out, and I was accepting to all that, and I knew I wanted more. But I, because I love the individual, I was accepting to that, and and I was wrong, because when a person wants you, they don't care who knows. So then you would say that's one of those situations where mm-hmm. they really didn't want you, because mm-hmm. if they really wanted you, they wouldn't, wouldn't be ashamed. Right, they wouldn't be ashamed of letting people know. Mm-hmm. Yep. Yeah. Some wanted to want the relation. They find out. You know, after the relationship is over. Well, after the relationship was over, it didn't, it didn't matter after that. <laughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> like, okay, I'm in a better place now. You ready to get back together? Mm-hmm. No. No. Mm-hmm. The thrill is gone. <laughs> <laughs> I like that barbecue. I like that. You do? Mm-hmm. It tastes like it, huh? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So, hey, Bobby. Hey, Bobby. You say, if a man slap me, that's my signature that he don't want. Yeah, yeah. If signature, it, confirmation, sealing, whatever, yeah, whatever. Yeah. That's still the deal. <laughs> Mm-hmm. And person they got to hit you to tell you they love you, to show you that they love you. That they ain't, don't love you. That ain't love. If a person got to hit you, that if ain't they love. They hit you. Hit you, you, you cuss you out, that's call a, you that's out your a, name. No, that's that that ain't hurt love. them to even see you cry. Like it hurts me to see her cry. Mm-hmm. That is not love. Mm-hmm. Yes, Roz. She's tearing that chicken up. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Love and chicken. Mm-hmm. Happy BJC. <laughs> mm-hmm. 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 What? Mm-hmm. Goodness, Jay, can you teach my fiance how my girlfriend, my fiance, how to cook? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Everybody got the eye on that chicken, baby. Mm-hmm. No, it's gonna be gone. They ain't gonna be looking at it too. You want another piece? Mm-hmm, I'm good. Oh. Mm-hmm. No abuse, love. Yep. Yep. Yep, a Mo, I finally got it. <laughs> mm-hmm. I dropped my bones. Somebody look good at me. So just in the relationship, right then and there, you tell me, you show me, you told me, Mm -hmm. but now you show me that you don't want me. So Mm -hmm. just move around. Mm -hmm. I'm asking. Wait, what? I was thinking about your French fries. I'm sorry. I was thinking about your French fries. I said. <laughs> yeah, she needs to slow down. I said, not only did you tell me, but mm-hmm. now that you've shown me that mm-hmm. you don't want me, then I just need to move around. I mean, no discussion to be had, right? Right. Now you don't need to talk about it. It, it, when it gets to that point, you've already gotten, you've already exalted your discussion. You've already got to the, ain't no more discussions to be had. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I mix that with this. I mix with ranch in this. Oh, that's what that is? It's ranch and jalapeno. Mm-hmm. Well, I'm just saying, y'all. I don't know. I, I don't know. I just get mad at it. Because I, I get upset because I've been there. 
and I know that I've accepted a lot of things and I still keep myself in the, in the at tail nine because of a lot of stuff that I allowed and I didn't have to. And I just remember back when my sister would tell me, you you ain't you don't owe nobody no explanation. You sing, you ain't got no kids, you you ain't got to put up with that. And so I hear my sister saying it in my ear and I remember her telling me that. But listening to it, I would just brush her off and I would go through that foolishness. Because she don't know what she's talking about. Because mm. that's what I used to say. Mm. Oh, when people would tell me something, I'd be like, they don't know what they're talking mm. about. <laughs> and my mama would say, love, me. child, love ain't supposed to hurt. <laughs> mm -hmm. Not like that. <laughs> well, flowers are used trying to make it work. Yeah, yes, I was. That's the like thing. Damn fool. But yeah. it only takes. It, it, it can't work when it's just the one person. That's how you know that the person ain't in it no more. They gone. No, well, in in my case, it mm -hmm. was always hiding. I couldn't be out. Mm -hmm. You know, they were hiding. They were hiding from their mama. They ain't, my, they, my mama know. I told my mama off the top. You know. But they were hiding from their mom, or hiding from their daddy, or hide, it was hiding from somebody. Well, you couldn't go to the Christmas party, couldn't go to the to the Thanksgiving dinner. You couldn't do that kind of stuff. Together. Yeah. And you had to pretend you were somebody else other than who you were really were. Yeah. Mm hmm <laughs> You can't lose yourself, that's for sure. What you say? Uh, what do you do when your daughter tells you it's better to be seen than heard? That hurt like hell. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, of course that's going to hurt. I, I, you know, all I say is I, I've always been a person that said how I felt. I ain't care how nobody felt about it because it was my feelings. When a person don't con you don't consider your feelings, why are you considering others? Hmm. <clears throat> Excuse me. If a person not caring about what you're saying and how you feel, why are you sitting around caring about how they feel and what they what how it's gonna look? If you're talking around their feelings, yeah, man. Hmm. What's I, up, DC? I always been open. I always been open. Then it started from when I got first when I first got molested. Th then that's where it come from. When I first got molested, and then it was said, you know, don't say nothing. They ain't gonna believe you or what? What? You or oh, I'm a kid and all that stuff. I ain't take that. I ain't look here. Let me tell you something. I ain't care. Because if I died that day, guess what? I'd been in a better place than where I was at that moment. So I always spoke out. Always spoke out. I don't care. I still don't care today. I'm going to say how I feel. As long as I'm not disrespecting you, I'm going to tell you how I feel. And there you go. So these people that walking around and hiding and, and in the closet and all that, mm -mm. they ain't doing nothing hurting you. And you going to bed with a headache and might not wake up the next morning because you stressed out in your damn sleep. Oh, well, mm -mm. Mm -mm. Thank you for the food, baby. You're welcome. <laughs> mm -hmm. I don't know. I just know when I ask people the truth, it may be a hard pill to swallow, but you get you well in the end. I accept it. <laughs> he ain't gonna kill you, that's for sure. Mm hmm. <laughs> mm hmm. Mm hmm. But again, a lot of people. I just like they to rather, own my they part. They rather hear, huh? I just like to own my part. Right. I want to make sure whatever I want to make sure whatever I'm involved in. It, you know, I'm owning my part. So, mm -hmm. your fries taste good. Uh, and if I had to ask for some fries, I'm going to eat them all. Right. <laughs> See, I'm owning my part. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. 
So yeah, everybody sitting around and in the corner and in the closet and don't want to tell mama, don't want to tell dad, and I don't want my friends to look at me this way, and I don't, mm, mm. Do you believe in karma? Yeah. Yes, I sure do. That's why I'm careful on how I treat folk. Mm -hmm. I'm careful on how I treat people simply because whatever happened and and karma come back around, it ain't going to hit you. No, excuse me. It ain't going to hit you. It's going to hit somebody close to you or your children. Hmm. And people don't, people don't realize that. They'll say, oh, I can take it. Or I can take it. And don't realize it's, mm -hmm. it's not going to attack you. It's going to take something that's close to you. What's going on, girl? Or it don't come back in the same mm -mm. form. Mm -mm. A lot of people not. think it's going to come back in the same. That's why they'd be like, oh, I can handle it. Mm -hmm. It's not going to come back in the same form. It's going to attack you. It's, it's going to look take, totally different. It's going to attack your finances. It's going to attack your health. It's going to It's going to attack. <laughs> Um, and believe me, when they come back, you gonna know. I promise you, you gonna know. You gonna remember when. <laughs> you gonna remember when. I'm a, I'm a living witness. I'm trying to tell you. I ain't always been on the up and up the way I am now. I paid a lot of prices of the debts I, I shit. <laughs> I'm trying to tell y'all. But it's all about, you know, growing, mm -hmm. experience, it's growing. Mm -hmm. That's gross. Mm -hmm. I say, how do you feel about telling only those who need to know? What you mean, Scooby? What you mean? I mean, I mean, I don't know what you mean, but it, my thing is, is I'm not me. I'm not a, a quiet individual. Um, <laughs> let me let me give let me give you an example. Say, Scooby. I say say I don't know you. Let me give you an example of what I'm talking about. And you say, Scooby, come, you, 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 Scooby, you say, hey, Swain, come with me to go to my homegirl house or my homeboy house. Well, I'm that individual. You might not say anything, but I'm going to let that individual know that I'm coming to that. I want them to know who I am. You, you see, because you don't want you don't want people coming to your house and you don't know that they predators or they they murderers or they they thieves. You know, you, you want to know the person that you... You know, yeah, bring it to the to their house. Mm -hmm. You know, so um, when there's a need to know, it's it's definitely a need to know when you have somebody around you. You know, um, people are funny about their children. So, and a lot of adults don't agree with same sex lifestyle. Well, people, people are, you want that individual to know. Hey, you know, look, I'm. You know, I'm I'm gay and I'm this and and I'm that this and a third and all that. Give that individual to say, okay, well, a child around it. You get what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Um, it's not. A, it's so much of a need to know. It's just they have that right to know who their child is around. I, if if I hope I'm making sense to y'all. Mm. Mm. And I'd rather know the truth than to, you know, sh shining over your child or, or don't move or you stay right here. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? And then making me feel some type of way. So I'm like this. I'm going to remove myself. <laughs> I'm going to remove myself. And so. you ain't got to treat me some type of way. So don't let a person tell you what you say twice that they don't want to. Oh. Mm -hmm. What's up, Bob Lady Nikki? So, mm -hmm. so I hope I, I made some sense to y'all. I know I get a little tired time and then I, my, my thoughts get ahead of what I'm saying. I get aggravated with some people because they allow some things to go on that they don't have to allow. And then you want to bring your people down with you or your friends down with you down that, that foolishness. And then when they tell you the truth, you get mad with them because right. you didn't told them the truth. And and I'm like this. I'd rather you tell me the truth than the, than the lie to me. Right. That's why I said a lot of people will sit up and say, 
oh yeah, tell me the truth, but they're only saying that because they're thinking that you're going to tell them what they want to hear. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, man. But I'd rather, I'd rather tell somebody the truth. Mm -hmm. Yes, indeed. And where's your six? Mm -hmm. Who's your six? Huh? Never mind. Mm -hmm. I'd rather somebody tell me the truth Oh, I need to put something on the back of it. Okay. That ain't um, I'd rather somebody tell me the truth. Mm -hmm. And again, it's going to be a hard pill to swallow depending on what they tell me, but it will be appreciated in the long run. Yeah. Well, I, I just, I don't know. I just, um, I just, I just rather somebody, I rather people be honest with me. That way I know how to deal with you. Don't be around me and you don't care for me. Well, you know. See, but you know what? Right. No one's gonna own up to it. Shit. <laughs> no, for real. No one's gonna own up to that. Mm -hmm. They'll own up to something else first before they own up to that yeah, they don't really reason. that they really don't care for you. Because mm -hmm. you know we have people in here all day long on this platform that oh yeah swinging da, 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 <laughs> and then their actions show different. Mm -hmm. Get in you know person acting like they don't know you. <laughs> so. Mm. You ain't got to show you. Like you said, you ain't got to tell me twice. You ain't got to tell me, but one time. I'm trying to tell you. I tell you what, I, I cut you off so quick like electricity that ain't been paid. <laughs> <laughs> I cut you off so quick, you be in the dark talking about what happened. <laughs> I, my cutoff game is, baby, tell you, my cutoff game is strong. Man. Yeah. Strong. Yeah, she said like yeah. the electricity ain't been paid. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, baby, mm -hmm. you paid the light bill. <laughs> <Man, I'm just, laughs> I gave you the money, baby. I'm just you know, saying. I gave you the money. Did you pay? Uh, do I need to call down there and see if you paid? <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> so can uh, you explain how someone else's lifestyle affects me. me? Exactly, it doesn't. Right. That's the thing. It shouldn't. It shouldn't. <laughs> not even five day grace period. No, <laughs> no, no, I no. Just, not even mm -hmm. a, no, not even a partial payment. I will cut you off. You know, and I still say, and, and I'll say because a person, you shouldn't put a person in that position to even be like that. You know what I'm saying? Right. Especially if I ain't asked for it. But then, hmm, hmm. I'm good. Mm -hmm. I'm good. I'm so good. I'm so good. I'm good. It's a payment arrangement. No payment arrangements over no, here. No. I just, I, I'm telling you. When they say go straight, go straight to jail. Mm -hmm. Do not, do not go past go. Under <laughs> mm -hmm. J had me cutting off people without a uh, notice, and I love it. <laughs> <laughs> Yep. <laughs> so, I mean, yeah, I'm not, I'm not saying be mean to folk, mm -mm. but that's your peace. That's for your peace. That's for you. Um, if it don't bring you peace, you shouldn't have it around you. So, um, again, I would say, don't let nobody tell you nobody. Don't let nobody tell you twice that they don't want you or they don't appreciate your friendship, your relationship, any type of shit. If they don't respect you enough to uh, to take your feelings into consideration, that relationship is not for you. I'm not saying that you have to you have to do whatever your friend or your significant other say. If they say, "Well, no, no, no," you know, like I don't want you to, I don't want you to get a, a new car. Mm -hmm. You know, no, I don't want you to get a new car. No, when when you're going like to them and just asking them their opinion, right. it doesn't mean that you have to always abide by what they say, right. but just consider my feelings like mm -hmm. I I matter. Right. Some people always feel like, well, I'm grown. I ain't got to ask her. It's not that you're asking. You're just, you're just considering that person's feelings because you're not in a relationship mm -hmm. by yourself. Mm -hmm. If that's the case, then you need to be by yourself. Yeah. Uh, but my, my, I have a question, y'all. Do y'all believe lack of attention can cause you to fall out of love with someone? Mm hmm Do you think or do you believe lack of attention can cause you to fall out of love with someone? If you go a long time, a long time, yeah. 
Yeah, it gives time to get used mm -hmm. to not. You don't ever want to give a person an, a, enough mm -hmm. time to get used to being by themselves. Yeah, give them enough time to forget. Yep. <laughs> they say yes. Mm -hmm. Okay, everybody's saying yes. All right, we're on the same page. <laughs> yep. Okay. Having regard for your significant other is important. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. So, with that being said, I have another question. <laughs> you so silly. <laughs> I seen something on the internet the other day that said never side with anyone against your spouse. Right. Never side with anyone against your spouse. And we had the discussion. Y'all want to hear what we said or y'all want to tell us what y'all say? So what do y'all think? What do y'all think about that? We'll tell y'all how we feel about it. <laughs> True that, correct? Not in Not public. Not in public, okay. okay. Uh, it's, it's a good which says a kiss 22 my wife cheated because i worked a lot she said uh not enough attention no that's not is that way wait, wait, wait we're gonna get back to the court this that's not a kiss 22. the thing is is that that should have been discussed when y'all first got together if she knew you worked a lot before now then that's not an excuse y'all or even if you didn't work a lot and you started to work a lot, when she felt like she wasn't getting enough attention, she should have she brought it to you. you. Right then. Now, yeah. if she didn't bring it to you until after she had got caught cheating, then <laughs> that's on her. <laughs> <laughs> so there's yeah. no catch-22 in that one. <laughs> yeah. Okay, now, now what's okay. the question again? Now, the question is, or the statement is, never side with anyone against your spouse. Right. So... Lack of attention leave the door open for others, others to enter. enter. Yep. Should it be like a revolving door if you leave it open too long? <laughs> I'm it not depends. discussing. I'm not wait a minute. I'm not discussing what goes on in my, my personal, personal relationship. Yeah. And uh, then plus size diva says it depends. Where? Where? Right up under white flower. Oh wait. What you mean it depends? Definitely Don't not in public. It. Definitely not in public. Exactly. So, so that's what we discuss. We, that's what. That's what we feel. We feel right. like if she's you know, wrong or if I'm wrong, I'm gonna address her when we're not around people. Right. But, but, however, if, if she's wrong, and I'm not gonna correct her, she's not gonna correct me in front of nobody. But once we get by ourselves and we correct each other, or you know whoever's wrong, mm. she then have to go to that individual and correct it in public because it was done in public. Go back to what Boss Lee Mickey said. I learned that if you can't talk to your spouse about it, it I'm, I'm not, not talking, talking to, to anybody. anybody. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. 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 So. Because that's what you had a problem with. You had a problem with your significant other. You don't have a problem with Shaniqua or Tyrone. <laughs> you know, you don't have a problem with them. You, you That's between you and your significant other. Right. We right. talked about the whole thing about not correcting each other mm -hmm. and that because what happens is, and I've seen it happen on social media, mm -hmm. what happens is I've seen people where they corrected their significant other, right? And then that gives other people that are watching, oh, yeah. okay, okay, so then, that, then they already know. Right. They, they know where to bite, you know what I'm saying? They right. know where to bite because they say, okay, I know what to do in mm -hmm. order to get I don't trust Shaniqua. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. You say people be looking for flaws in a relationship. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Right. Exactly. So that's what I was saying. And that's a way for them to, to get in. So when you do that, people see, okay, this is an end. Right. And um, you should just never do that to me. That's just disrespectful. You can, you can um, discuss that privately right. and say, baby... Baby, you know you was wrong. Right. But then would you go and... See, because if, 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 if it, it, was, it, it was done publicly, well, right? Actually, that's what I was going to say. If it's done... P public and, 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 and then I'll say, say if it's me, you, DC, TLC, right. and, and, and uh, Wildflower, right. and we all having a discussion, and then... And you then know, I, I, I don't agree with what they, you're saying. They all disagreed, and then you just didn't say anything, and then when you get home, you're like, baby, you know you was wrong, and then when you, you know, right. elaborate, and I'd be like... Yeah, you're right. So right, then, would you? Right. So then, would you correct it in public? I mean, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, if I did yeah. it in the group, then I'd be like, you know what, y'all got home, baby. <laughs> we was talking, 
and I see now. You're, you're my bad. Y'all right. Y'all right. <laughs> I, okay. I, y'all. But see, because, you can say that that's a that, that's a bigger person to come and say yeah, well, yeah, yeah, that you're wrong because I've done it on live, but you didn't bring it to my attention. I you actually check myself. Yeah. So yeah. I jacked somebody up on live. And then I thought about it later on when I went back to watch the live, and I was like, "Oh, I miss I mis misunderstood." Right. And so right. I apologized to the individual on live. So I didn't go in her inbox right. and apologize. I'm like, if you I was being disrespectful on live, then I apologize on live. And, so. it, and it, that's what yeah. people should do, you know. So okay, so when see we different, y'all. We different. <laughs> we different. When a person have an issue with somebody in the live, mm -hmm. you know, um, can I I can use Shanae and, and Tasha, like when yeah. they like okay like like we were in Shanae and and um, Tasha. Tasha's live one mm -hmm. one day and Tasha somebody was a uh, addressing Tasha in a way that they weren't supposed to or or it came off as being. It's, you it's know, not what you say, it's how you say yeah, it. Yeah, get that delivery, you know, I'm not talking to you, I'm talking to your wife, you know, and stuff like that. And so Tasha wanted to deal with that individual where Shanae didn't see it. And so what I was telling baby is, you know, Tasha don't owe nobody exp explanation on why she don't, she feels she don't deserve disrespect. She muted the individual. It wasn't, so when... It, the only problem I had with it is that when, when she said, well, I'm going to tell you off live. And I'm like, no, you don't give people prejudice over your relationship or what's going on in the live. If it's happening in the live, you correct it right then. You, you, ch you check them then. Yeah. And the thing is, the thing about that is, uh, say, for instance, if, because I think somebody had done that to us in the live once before, too. Right. And, you know, then they, you know, are talking to baby, but then I say something, they'd be like, well, I was talking to her. Yeah, well, no, well you, you talking, talking to her, her you, you talking, talking to me. Yeah, you talking to both. So if you don't <laughs> want to talk to me, then you can kindly escort yourself out the exit <laughs> But see, but she, they, they didn't see that part. Right, right. You know, and, right. and so my but thing that's was... Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. But that's okay. The only thing is that even though Shanae didn't see it, right, right. right. Wifey saw it, right, and it should have been enough, and, and 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 that's enough. That's enough. She shouldn't have to explain, or she can say, well, "Well, I explained to you what happened. We'll get offline, you know." But right. just know that they they blocked. You know what I'm saying? I shouldn't have to. A no, no, I, that's what I'm saying. The right. thing I had the issue with right. is Tasha didn't want to say who it was. Right. And okay. my and my thing is she was trying to yeah. And, and my thing is no disrespect. My thing is I want you. I, I'm gonna deal if baby see a problem with let's just say say baby have a problem with DC. Well, I want baby to say well I want DC blocked out of this live. Right. Right. You see what I'm saying? Right. So DC will know that I know that she know. You see what I'm saying? And that we all know. Yeah, that right. we all know. So you you get what I'm saying? So when other Sorry, people see <laughs> so when other people see that we're checking people up front and out loud, they won't get in nobody else live and try to mess with somebody else. So wherever you cut up, that's where I'ma act up. <laughs> disrespect to my mate, it's like disrespect to me. You right about that one. I like that. Wherever yeah. you cut up I'm at. <laughs> Wherever you cut up, yeah. I'm gonna have to. Yeah, so you know, I'm I'm like this for future reference, y'all. When you gotta check somebody, you check them right then because your your partner takes precedence over anything that's going on. I'm with you. In there. I'm with you because you know what? <laughs> I hate when people send subliminal message and they'll be like, cause old girl, she yeah. tripping. Well, look at old girl. <laughs> Is she tripping? Go on and call old girl out because I am yeah. notorious for calling people out. So be careful what you say because I will call you, I will call you out. And yeah, that, she said, let me know so I can let you know. <laughs> right. <laughs> yeah, so yeah, I despise subliminal message. Yeah, yeah. So yeah. Don't, you know, I mean, I, I just hate it even in corporate world where they'll do that. They'll be like, well, someone wore shorts today. Okay, tell the someone. Yeah. Don't well, send out a big email. Who is they? What they yeah. say, who is they? Yeah. Bro. Yeah. <laughs> who is they and how come I don't know who they are? Okay. <laughs> I want to know who they is. <laughs> yeah. You know, so, so you, because sometimes some people don't think that you're talking about them. They'd be like, oh, I know she ain't talking to me. And then be, you so be the main you one. Have to. You have and to. you be the main one. Right. How did they even catch that shit? I'm trying, I caught it and it wasn't even me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to see something.
wrong. Um, <laughs> but yeah, just yeah, you know. So that's the that's that's what way we feel about the whole thing checking your spouse in public. Yeah. So. I, I can't stand disrespect. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And see, the thing is, you didn't see, I don't think you saw the, the comment, but we saw it on our end and your wife saw it. So we, I was like, damn, okay. You know, the only problem I had was when she said, well, I ain't gonna tell you, I'm gonna tell you when. And I'm like, no, you tell. Like, 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 this was me. Yeah. This was me. <laughs> <Ooh>. <laughs> They be like, it ain't your life, baby. Yeah, it ain't your yeah. life. I wish her. <laughs> and, and you know, it's in the, the individual product didn't mean anything bad. Right. But it was the delivery and how if I took it that way, your wife took it that way, and everybody else, you know, hey, you know. Because I noticed you said, well, I, you know, they a good individual and this, that. But people change. People switch up. People switch up. Understand? People, yeah, people they switch do. up. So. <clears throat> She said, I was a ninja wood. <laughs> I'm not going to address things immediately because the bond is higher than the premarital sex. Yeah. yeah. And that's what people have a problem here. Mm-hmm. Is because we don't play that. Yeah. Like, I don't, I don't care who you are. Yeah. I, I promise you, I don't care who you are. I got my baby back. Yep, and I got her. I mean, I don't care who you are. You can be bestie. <laughs> you can be cousin. Yep. I don't care. You can be family. <laughs> you can, I, yeah, you can be family. I said cousin. Oh, man. I, yeah. I don't care. Yeah. Because wrong is wrong. I will check you and you going to feel it. Where you can be like, you know what? I ain't going to say nothing else. Bye, y'all. <laughs> Woo, glad they gone. <laughs> oh, baby. What's going on, Munchkin? You What's late. What's going on, Munchkin? You late. What's up? What's going on, Marcia? And that's how it should be. Yeah. yeah. Um. But yeah, yeah. Um. Just y'all learn it's a to checkmate. <laughs> hey, Tiff. Uh, I'm glad she caught it because people will keep doing stuff. Yeah. Um. And if you let it pass, yeah, yeah. yeah. And another thing, you know, I'm with you. When you, said, you know what, wifey, she's so sweet. She's so <laughs> sweet, and I think some probably that person probably knew, right. you know, that she's so sweet that she wouldn't, you know, let let me off in there. <laughs> They'll be like, who well, is you know, it was, it was, it was just done in a disrespectful way, yeah, you yeah. know, because. You, because you have to understand when you're talking to one, you're talking to both. Right, right. You know, you just, you directing it at one, but you ain't finna disregard that my ass sitting right here. Mm-hmm. You know, um, that's, that's what I got on it. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. But I like the way it was handled. I do. I, and because she, you, she was saying that people wanted to, them to make more video to prove that they was together. No, right. They ain't got to prove that. They just, right. They you just said you video. said at the same time when Shanae said, we want to prove nothing <laughs> to nobody. Yeah, it's just videos. And I'm like, what video? How videos going to prove that y'all together? I'm mm-hmm. just trying to see some. The people you are know. still asking us, so. And you and Shanae, they stop running. I'm telling you in front of 271 people, when you disagree with something, stop running and, and, and be get mad and, and be wanting to get off live. You tackle that motherfucker and tell him to kiss your ass and keep, being, keep the loud because I be enjoying myself. <laughs> <laughs> I be enjoying, enjoying myself in the live and then when you really want to get hey, off, Gina. I get upset. I don't like my shit. They done made her mad. Now she done got off the live <laughs> and then I can't tell them nothing because that's her live, but you know. Woo! <laughs> she stopped running from folks. Shit. Let them know. If, you don't, if they don't like what you're saying, tell them to scroll up and go down and go to the level right. But they ain't got to stay here. <laughs> hey, Miss Loyalty. Mm-hmm. Um, but that's it. That's what we got. That's what we that's got. That's crazy. Let me see what else I got. Let me see. make sure. They put a horse again, baby. <laughs> Thank you, Miss Lorenzi. Did I have anything else? Uh, <laughs> you ain't got no more? Yeah. We appreciate y'all being in here and having it loud the way we had it. It was, it was interesting. I just hope that we, you know, we help some people. You Let's know? be honest, y'all. Let's just, can we, can we talk? Are yeah. we family? Can yeah. we talk? Yeah, we, we family. We're going to keep it real? Yeah. We just talked about keeping it real. <laughs> y'all, let's keep it real. Uh, okay. Now, be honest. 
if a man or woman, depending on what your sexual orientation is, ah, <laughs> if they if they told you the truth that he or she only wanted a friend with benefits, would you consider? So if someone told you that they just want friends with benefits, would you consider it? Yes. Okay. See now. Okay. Hell now. Nah. <laughs> okay. No. Yes, indeed. Yes, I am grown. Okay. No, absolutely not. Okay. So we got a little mixture here. Would you say if <clears throat> I respect, I respect that they, they give, give you the option? option. I'm with you, you know today. You see how I'm looking over here? Facts. Because she said, depends on all what the invent what the benefits are. <laughs> what? Look at all the fine print. Well, let me see. Okay. Uh, number six. Is, is that is that optional or <laughs> <laughs> under uh, one condition? <laughs> oh man. Uh, at the stage of my, my life, life no. no. I'm with you, Margo. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> That benefits better be worth it. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? Uh, and I and I even told baby this. I said you'll be surprised if you'll be surprised how many people not that we were talking about it. We were we was watching the show. A lot of this stems from like shows or stuff that I seen. Mm -hmm. And baby was like, Well, I mean, why he just didn't um what was it? It was somebody that that did that. That wanted to be friends with you know, just wanted to be friends with benefits. Yeah, and, and I'm then like, I said, why didn't they just be single? Why they have to be in a relationship? Single? And I yeah. said, you'd be surprised how many women will, depending on what that man look like, will fall. You know, will say, yeah, I'll do it just for the sake of having a piece of the pie. Hmm. I'm yeah. just saying. The only thing I had to share is my Netflix password. What's your password? What's your password? Because I'm tired of paying the bill. What's your password? <laughs> yeah. Hell no to the no, no, no. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> okay. So, since we're all talking about keeping it real, mm -hmm. how many of you guys went through a whole stage? What, man? <laughs> of you guys went through a whole stage. What's a whole stage? Define whole stage. You know what a whole is. No, see, define whole stage because a lot of relationships that I've been in, they were relationships that I was the only one in the relationship. So, it, because I've had so many relationships, you a whole, baby. I'm not, I'm not really I'm a whole. <laughs> You I've have had several relationships within a, a short period so of time. So Cheryl said me. I mean, hey. Hey, hey Gail. Hey, Gail. <laughs> Breath, please. <laughs> I don't have enough hands to write. What do you say? My granny says a whole chapter, not a novel. I, I. <laughs> oh, man. Sweeney, I did was in the night. No, I'm just saying that it's. it's no, 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 no. What I mean. several. Relationship. Not, not if he was in a relationship. No, we're talking about just not. Most people are ho hoish or have hoish tendencies or hoish behavior. Not being in relationships, you know, like being with this person. Next week they're with this person. Oh, wait, you know, no, this, I ain't, I ain't never like You know, that. they okay. they they pass the ten fingers, you know, and you know, and all that and stuff. And baby, huh? We don't want to have to see the rehab now. <laughs> I was something else in my twenties. I know it was the blood that protected me. Yeah, yeah, and my twenties are behind me. <laughs> we say, don't judge me. <laughs> I just spread the Lord. Stop that. <laughs> oh man. Okay. Okay. Um, <laughs> well. This is just you know, a little fun, little question, a uh, little TMI. You don't have to answer. Okay. But you know, we're talking about being honest and all. Okay. So, how many of y'all can clap uh, with no hands? I ain't, I ain't Swing. No That's not, we're not talking about that kind of clapping. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I didn't know 
Ooh, yeah. <laughs> Baby, <laughs> say. I know. You guys warn me on these damn questions. I just said. No. I bet so you. I said no comment. I bet, I bet your munchkin got that too. I bet she got it. <laughs> I know she. I know she's screen recorded that one. <laughs> See, she said, "Get off live now." <laughs> <laughs> the baby said, "I said, I said, no." You said, "I was like, I did it." <laughs> Munchkin, we gotta go back and watch that one. Ooh. See, I'm innocent. Because I didn't know. I ain't know. I'm innocent wildflower. Wait a minute, wildflower, what you say? <laughs> <laughs> I thought you had literally thought you were saying no hands. Yeah, no hands. Them two cheeks that go Ah. <laughs> 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 oh, man. Oh, uh, man. Okay, that was a good one. Switching gears. You gotta go on that one. Since we all being honest and I, all, we I, all family, right? I wouldn't How many of y'all have a toe longer than your big toe? The toe next to your big toe is longer than your big toe. <laughs> Y'all have a toe that's longer My than your big toe. My toes are even. I got some pretty feet. I got pretty feet. I ain't gonna do it. I got pretty feet though. <laughs> I got pretty so feet. Not me. Not mine. No, not me. I do. I admit to it. Ain't no shame in my game. My my toe next to my big toe look like this. <laughs> I'm just saying. That's one thing I gotta admit. I do not have pretty toes. Even though people will tell me, well, my friends will tell yeah, me, just she paint, had, she just had paint your toes. Me. Just paint your toes. She had her feet for me. That that's the one thing that she cute. continuously mm -hmm. she continuously do with me. I know it's something ugly. Feet. I don't wanna see it. Your feet are not ugly to me. She'll hide them feet, baby. I'm telling you, she get out of the bed as soon as she can put them in some shoes. So she get out of the bed. This ain't that toe giving the finger. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not A and W. She caught me off guard with that one. <laughs> oh man, that's mm. all I have for today. That was fun though. Mm -hmm. That was fun. Mm -hmm. I started to recap some of the hood Jeopardy questions, but I was like, nah, because we already know the answers. Yeah. It wasn't fun. Yeah, what happened to Tariq? They had no episode on the um when it come back on, y'all. I didn't I thought I didn't know. What happened to um Power Book? He ain't had one ain't come on yesterday. When it come back on? Next week. Why not why didn't it come on this week? I don't understand seasons and, and okay, explain to me premieres and season finales and why they but do it's not a season, season finale though. I'm just saying. But why they do it like that when it's gonna come back on? I don't I don't get it. I don't get how they how they do shows like that, but like they'll skip a week. I'm not understanding because before, like, you know, Knox Landing in Dallas, they came on faithfully. Dallas came on faithfully every Friday until it was the Who Shot JR or mm -hmm. you know, the the cliffhanger. Writers so. on strike. Oh, well, I know that, but I don't know what that. I knew okay. I heard that they were on strike, but I don't know what that. I don't know what that means. Okay, so, I don't know what that so, means. Okay, okay, but I have a question though. Is it behind so, money? Is it behind money, y'all? I'm just trying to understand. It's I don't know what the, money. what the strike is about. I don't know. Until the writers come off strike, they're only playing re reruns or nothing, nothing at all. Wrong. Got you, not producing. Okay, <laughs> got you. I they ain't letting Mother's Day interfere with the ratings. <laughs> okay, yeah. It's always about money, absolutely. But, but I mean, I understand, though. Are you getting paid? Just getting paid, not getting paid enough. Okay, well, I didn't know. What's going on with the independent? They want, they want fair wages. Uh, yeah, it's always about it's always about money. I didn't know. Well, 
So then we don't know for sure that it'll be back then on the 31st. I mean, if they're on strike, have, if they haven't settled yet, right? So we don't know if it's going to be back on. I don't get this kind of stuff, y'all. So, uh, yeah, forgive me. If somebody writes an episode, they don't wait. If somebody writes an episode, they don't want them to air it without fair compensation. They can't. Um, no settlement? Okay. So that we don't know for sure how long this will go, go on. They have a script but can't release it yet. The writers want higher paid, better deals, and better contract. Okay, okay. I mean, I didn't, I didn't, I honestly didn't know it was such a thing. I, I mean, I know. Well, I mean, it's, it's, it's right. Yeah, I, I and it's no different than probably a majority of these shows, right, are doing really, really well. Mm -hmm. And they did, you know, a lot of people don't put that in the forecast as seeing it, you know, doing well. Then if it does well, then we'll start paying you. X amount of dollars, and so now that this has happened, they all just like, okay, these shows are doing well on Netflix or right. you know Peacock or whatever it may be. We want so now the the, the the writers thing that that has everything to do right like with different seasons shows, shows mm -hmm. like like um, Power and and, and Chicago PD mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. uh, okay. I didn't know, yeah, but the production companies are, what you say, but the production companies are threatening to use artificial intelligence program to write script. But that's not going to work. What that mean? Um, what that, what that, what that, that, that mean, that, Coco, Coco mm -hmm. Cutie? That's not going to work only because you're still taking the, you know, you're leaving it, they're leaving it up to like the computers to, you know, to, to write the scripts, you know what I mean? And stuff. Uh, and that's not, that's not, <clears throat> that's not going to work. Yeah, that ain't going to taking ain't the human, you're like taking it. the human side out of it. That's not going to, that's not going to work. And that has anything to do with, I know people are all for, um, uh, reality, technology. You say re reality of it away. Right. Okay. It takes the personal eye. out of it. Yeah. Okay. Okay. I, I appreciate y'all explaining because I'm. Um, and that's not going to work. And everybody's always for, um, what do you call it? Mm -hmm. What do you call that? What? Um, no. What? Um, electronic, you know what I'm talking oh, to say. Okay. Um, technology. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But technology isn't always good. Okay, so now I got a question. I asked baby this the other day. I don't know if she explained What's it. What's up, Kingstead? I don't, ain't Kingstead, but I don't know if she explained it. I don't know, but I'm going to ask y'all. Why these, why do the, the, the football players and the basketball players get millions and billions of dollars? How, I mean, but why do they get so much money? <laughs> I asked you that the other day. Why they get so much money and they only going up and down the court and they playing for somebody? You know, it ain't like they. they I don't understand what that means, Mo. You know, because football players get millions and millions of contracts and. and <clears throat> Endorsement. I'm just trying to understand Sazerade. It is, you know, because, and the reason why I ask is because mm -hmm. they, they, they're they always saying people need money and, and the government running out of money. I don't understand none of that talk. I'm just saying what I hear. And I'll be like, well, how they running out of money if they paying all these basketball players and football players all these millions and millions of dollars and they go buy this big old house and they can only be in one room? This is stuff I'll be thinking about. <laughs> this is stuff I'll be thinking about. And you can only drive one car, but you got Ferraris and, and, and Rolls Royces, and I don't get it. Mm -hmm. <sighs> so, and I can understand that, you know, the doctors and lawyers and police officers and, you know, uh, judges, I understand how they get their money, but... Run up and down the field and run up and down the court. I don't get it. I, but I ain't knocking nobody to make they might make your money, boo boo. I'm just just trying to understand. And not paying taxes when it's gone. <laughs> they bringing in the other people's money. It's it's a, I, I don't understand, Janine. I promise I don't. When it comes to marketing and 
stuff that I don't get it. I mean, that's no different than you bringing in what you do, what you do for a living. You, you, you bringing in the money by going to these customers, making the deliveries that you make. Right. But so, I don't but, make, but, but, I don't but, make. But no, 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 no. Well, we ain't got to go off into what you make, but I'm just saying, you don't. No, they don't pay me what I'm worth. No, but what I'm saying, and exactly. So you, that's the way you feel, and that's the way that these ball players feel because they're, they're, their bodies are being used and abused or getting beat up on these fields. Right, but it's not worth millions and millions of dollars. To them it is. I get beat up at work every day. They ain't paying me no damn million and I'm dragging a hole Well, I'm sure if you were able to renegotiate a contract that was worth it and they would bring them millions, I'm sure they would. Yeah? No? Hello? (laughs) No, I don't get paid like that. I, I don't get paid like that. Two hundred billion dollar business, mm-hmm. and their but bodies get beat it. up. You know what I mean? My their body bodies. get beat up. No, but I'm just saying they get they get, no. Yours don't get you don't you don't risk getting your neck broke. You don't risk. Yes, I do. I drive a truck. You know what I'm saying? I'm you don't not. get hit head on like they get head on like football players and stuff. That's what I'm I saying. I pull a hose, baby, and them hoses is, is, is... I know what you're saying, honey, but I'm saying with them, you're asking why they're getting paid so much. So I'm telling you, this is the deal. Not only is it a billion dollar business, right, but their bodies are getting beat up, so they have to be compensated somehow for putting their bodies through all that abuse. You say, why do you buy the Dallas Cowboys? Because I like it. That's it. It is. It, I like it, and and the thing I like the Seahawks, the Atlanta Hawks, the the. the you like whoever. I like whoever. <laughs> you see what I'm saying? So it's not. That's just what it is. I just I just like the, the 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 logo. So um. Yeah, uh, duh, I'd be talking them trying to tell her she ain't trying to hear me. <laughs> yeah, the, the truck driving is something. Oh, I know. I mean, I know that. I'm just saying you're asking about, you know, yeah. athletes. As an educator, we definitely don't get paid what we're worth. I mean, yeah, and then have to deal with the the, the kids nowadays. I, I'm surprised school's still open. <laughs> Because I sure wouldn't be able to do it. You find your kid sitting out on the curb. <laughs> uh, yeah, going live tomorrow and Sunday. Oh, uh, yeah, tomorrow and then Sunday to be Sunday morning. But not sure what time. If we're going live tomorrow, it'll be around probably about 2 o'clock tomorrow. And Sunday, it'll be Sunday morning. They are providing services to people who like it. Mm-hmm. Whew. He said he locked up for a day of school. Yeah. <laughs> uh, uh, so I was don't get uh, paid what we... No, we don't. And they get upset. Hey, my, my dispatcher uh, tell me uh, the other day, talking about what's your slicker suit size is. If I had, I, they ain't finna pay me for a hazmat load. No, I don't. I ain't finna put that on. I ain't finna put that mess on. No. They don't pay me right now. They don't want me, they want me to, No, I ain't doing that. Now I gotta put that shit on and still don't get paid now. Uh, did y'all open y'all pay? Yes, we did. Yeah, yes, we did. did. Yeah, we appreciate we did. it. We appreciate it. Yeah. We love reading your letters. I, I love the penmanship. We love reading your letters. We love uh, reading your letters. So, uh, the. Whew. Let's see. Uh, I hate they don't stand up for what's right. They. The, they blind out justice. Mm-hmm. These kids nowadays will have you catching a case. Yep. Miss mm-hmm. <clears throat> J, look for your look for your package. Huh? Most say look for your package. I don't know. Uh, okay. You gotta send a. She send a tracking number or something. Nuh-uh. You gotta send a tracking number, Mo. So, next package will be for spring birthday. Oh, thanks a lot. I'll be 53 this Speaking year. Speaking of y'all, how many of y'all gonna fly in for sweet birthday? Why not? <laughs> I'll be 53 this year. Yeah. Ooh, Lord, thank you. What you doing? Cleaning up the kitchen? Yeah, I got an issue. Yeah. So we going live on Sunday. 
We're going live on Sunday for Mother's Day so that we can get in here and tell everybody Happy Mother's Day on Sunday. So we'll be on here Sunday morning. Yes, Sheila. Yeah, Sheila. Got your sucker. I'm gonna get your sucker. I see you. Huh? Now I was telling Sheila, I see she remember my birthday. Oh man. But DC and I'm ready for the wedding. I'm ready to I'm ready for the wedding. I'm ready for Janet. I'm ready for Janet as well. I'm oh that's your birthday too? I didn't know. Okay. All right, all right. How are you turning? How are you turning, Sheila? Uh, we'll be in the house for your birthday. Okay. Yeah, I'm ready for the wedding. It's turning 43 this week. But enjoy them for them parties, because when you get these pictures, your body start aching. <laughs> <laughs> you be 66, okay. Uh, wait, so when does my birthday coming up start? Ah, hey, in July, July 1st. July 1st. Yeah. What'd you say? Oh, you guys gotta make it to the episode. Not if I gotta take a damn shot. I'm not doing it. I don't think you got to this time. I don't know. That was last that was last year. Yep, now I gotta tell you something. I have to do a meet and greet for my birthday. I don't know. Y'all wanna meet me? Y'all wanna meet us? Y'all wanna meet us? I saw a lady today, uh, when I went to go get my, my car service, I saw a lady today. She said, you, um, 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 I was like, yeah. <laughs> uh, <laughs> oh, you know, and I'm gonna sit down. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> so you, um, 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 yeah. Ah. <laughs> uh, Hey right, baby, you got anything else before we get out of here? No. Stop singing a song, baby. I'm so glad we had the time together. Together. Just to have a laugh or sing a song. Song. I think we just get started and before you know it. Know it. Comes the time we have to stay so long. So long. Tell them bye, baby. Bye, baby. Alright, see y'all tomorrow around 2 o'clock. Probably earlier while she, while she getting out, fixing uh, her makeup on her face. I'll probably get on here early with y'all and then we'll get on and then have a conversation. So, tell them bye, baby, again. Bye, baby. Bye, y'all.